everyone and so welcome back to some more Animal Crossing. I forgot there's a whole Easter event. I don't know when it started. I'm pretty sure it started like way before today. So I don't know why I'm just now getting these eggs. Maybe because it's officially like day two. But I'm really excited. I didn't get any like notification that it's day two today. So I'm a little bit- Oh, hi bud! I, I guess because it's actually Easter today. Hello everyone! How is it already bunny day? It feels like the year just started. Whatever, it's time to find me some good eggs. Yeah, I'm sure. Okay, well, let's go ahead and run around, uh, see what we can find. I guess Blather still isn't here, which worries me a little bit. This spot is reserved for Blather's tent. It's definitely the next day, yeah, because it's 4-4, so I don't really know what's going on. Um, I'm- oh, no, absolutely not. Okay, so we're gonna go in here. <laughs> I mean, we don't even have a shovel, so it's not like I can really work on getting the bunny day recipes. I mean, I'm not too pressed about it because I'm not a huge fan of them anyway. But let's talk to Tom Nook, see what we can do today. Ah, Jesse, hello, hello. What would you like to talk to me about? I'm all ears. Uh, what should I do? Yes, yes, that is the question. By the way, thank you so much for finding a place for Blathers set up. Uh, but you're looking for a practical suggestion, hmm? Well, your lovely future home is already under construction, so perhaps it's time to start thinking about furnishings, hmm? May I humbly suggest checking out the Nook shopping at the Nook shop? Um... Okay, I feel like the game's broken. <laughs> might just be me though. Uh, we might have to time travel a day and then time travel back and just see what happens. Yeah, because this feels very broken. I feel like something was supposed to happen today and it's definitely not. So let me see what I could do about fixing it. Uh, but before I do that, I might go ahead and do some bunny day stuff because why not? Oh, okay, so we get all the recipes. I was just talking to him, uh, or at least we get a bunny day arch recipe. Okay, well that's nice to know. That's the one I use for spring anyway. So that's pretty good. The only ones we can really get are the fishing, um, the trees, and oh gosh, I guess the balloons too. But yeah, uh, something's definitely broken with my game today, so I'm a little bit worried. Oh, hi! We'll go ahead and talk to you though. Look how cute you look! Oh, speaking of birds! Okay, I'll just kind of skip through this while I'm talking. Uh, so I- I don't know if I told you guys this, but I had like little robins- Hi doll! As she's shaking in the background, that's my dog. Um, I had little robins kind of nest inside my wreath, and uh, they finally hatched, so there's like four or five of them. They're super, super cute. Um, they're little like fur balls, and they look like- they look a little weird to be on- Oh, ah, balloon! <laughs> I'm sorry, I haven't had many balloons, so even if it's an egg day one, I get really excited. But yeah, yeah, it's been just like really cute to watch them, but I'm so scared to like open my front door because they're just like right there. Yeah, okay, it's just it's just an egg. A little sad, but that's fine. Uh, so why don't we open this and at least get the Nook Miles. Also, one of them uh, fell yesterday out of the nest and my dog almost ate it, but I was able to pick it up in time and save him. So he's fine now. Uh, the mom came back and stuff. I made sure they're all like alive, just kind of like looking, making sure they're all like moving a little bit. They were. So I'm pretty confident about that. But yeah, that was uh, scary for a little bit. Oh, all these dirt patches are eggs. I forgot about that too. We don't have a shovel yet. Okay, I'm gonna go to tomorrow, try and fix what's wrong with this game and come back. Okay, so now we get the Tom Nook notification. So I'm thinking it was just because of Bunny Day. They decided uh, to just kind of have a null day of nothing, I guess. Island-wide broadcast full of island updates, going-ons, and such. I'll go over a few things that are very important to island life, so let me your island ears for a short time. Now, it's only fitting that we kick off the daily ritual with a doozy of island announcements. Oh no, a lot of reading. The airport is now open for business. Gonna kind of skip through this. I can use online communications. Okay, uh, postal service is open, and... The residence center is open 24 hours. Good to note, um, Blathers will be joining us. Blathers has a key interest in biology, we know this, skipping through a lot of this stuff, cause Tom Nook does ramble on. And we really don't need to listen to all of it, cause it is a lot. But yeah, I'm really excited, I'll probably go back, um, actually I probably won't go back to Bunny Day, let's be real, um, <laughs> like I said before. It's an interesting one, I think it's just cause Zipper scares me. Oh, so it's actually Easter when I'm recording this, um, and I tried to go to Target today after I spent like Easter with my family. Look at my little house, it's so cute! Oh my goodness, hold on, I wanna take, I wanna take a little picture of this real quick. Uh, let's do this, and we, oh, we don't have any emotions. Okay, cool, it's just gonna be a little sketch. That's fine. Oh, cute! Uh, but yeah, I tried to go to Target because I wanted to, um, get the- I forgot I ordered the Princess Peach dress. <laughs> my bad. 
I wanted to get the Amiibo cards for the Sanrio collection and Target's closed. Everything's like closed today. And I was like, oh yeah, that makes that makes logical sense. Oh, this is Bunny Day Arch. I guess we could learn this. Why not? Uh, I learned the Bunny Day Arch. Yay. Okay, let's try and change into an outfit that's a little bit more fitting, which is the pin princess. Yep, I'm leaving it. Princess Peach dress. Um, It's something. It's definitely not nothing. That's for sure. What do we have here? What an end table. Okay, we'll go ahead and learn that one. Uh, yay! And then we'll see what our gift from mom is real quick. And that is bears! Alright, well I guess we could plant those, which is pretty nice. Uh, let's see what the Nook Miles program wants us to do today. So dream house, because we built it, how exciting! We'll go ahead and get the Nook Miles today. But I hope everyone had a good, chill Easter. Mine was pretty relaxing, like I said. Oh, I forgot there's just a tent. All I did was really just have lunch with uh, my mom and my aunt. And it was just pretty chill. I didn't really have to travel too far and everything was kind of just low key. Uh, we were done in like an hour or two, which is a perfect amount of time for me. And then uh, just went home and took a nap because it's like really hot outside. <laughs> and just, yeah, it was perfect nap weather. A pleasure to meet you. My name is Blathers. I'm exceedingly interested in the ecosystem of this island. Thus, I have come to conduct research, if you will. Ah, could it be that you are Jesse? Uh, there's only one human on this island, tis I. Uh, yes, I am. A splendid job indeed, thanks to you, I was able to- Oh, look at him, he's so proud of himself! Oh, that's too cute. Uh, with nary a ruffled feather. Now, regarding the aforementioned research, truth be told, I'm determined to open a museum and henceforth dwell on this island amongst you. So, I really wish- I'm gonna kind of skip through this a little bit. I wish, like, he got to keep his tent for a little bit longer, because it's just, like, it's so cool, and we only really see it kind of for one day if you're fast at getting all the, uh, bugs and fish. But it's just like, it's really cool to see the island start off and just be like a little rustic and not really like super developed like a lot of the islands um, we're used to seeing at this point. Because people have had like a year on it, so it's gonna be, oh yes, like a little wooden phone, look at that. Oh no, it's a fossil phone. Oh, that makes me so happy. Uh, there, you see with wood gathered from Valaris, one can, uh, oh, the vaulting pole. Yes, there we go. Oh, and a shovel, perfect. So we can go back and get the bunny day eggs if I so choose. Which again, I'm not sure. Um, probably not, but <laughs> we we had the option to now, which is pretty exciting. I also think um, I need to sell a few things. We need an inventory upgrade is what we need. Um, I think it's just a Nook Miles program thing. Yeah, I could sell some of these shells, but for the most part, I need to keep a lot of this stuff. Um, I also put a lot of things in my house, like some of the wood and everything, but we'll fill up. Is this full? Uh, okay, we can get one more and then we'll donate all of these and then run back out. I actually um, time traveled a little bit last night to the start of Easter and I just didn't realize it was Easter because I didn't really go that far. I just kind of went and caught bugs um, and everything uh, just so we had stuff to donate today. Okay, so let's make a donation. Marvelous. Well, I'd show the first one and then I'll probably just cut out the rest because it's going to be a pretty lengthy progress or progress yet yeah, process this must be a seahorse yes it is might interest you in a few fun facts we'll do one we'll treat ourselves a little today i would love nothing more a uh, favorite of mine to be sure uh this seahorse is a very unique creature and it is indeed a fish oh fun fact i did not know that uh, though as far as fish go, seahorses are not great swimmers. The seahorse, you see, has but a wee fin on its back, which propels it through the water wa rather poorly. I can't talk today. Thus, these fish are often found using their uh, prehensile tails to hold tight amongst the seagrass. And here's one final fact for you. Seahorses have no stomach. Oh, really? And they must constantly feed to stay alive. Indeed, the life of a land horse sounds far easier than that of the hard-working horse of the sea. And there you have it. Fascinating stuff, no? Uh, bravo and thank you. Once the museum is complete, it shall be displayed with the utmost dignity. Okay, cool. So I'm going to go back and I wonder if you have anything else that could be donated. Oh, I got stuff. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and do all this, donate all my things and probably clear up my inventory a little bit, craft the shovel and whatnot. Just stuff that's like just mundane, not really exciting. Oh, we got a little cutscene. I went ahead and donated all the fish and bugs that I could. You can't donate deep sea items to blathers when restarting your island. So we'll have to wait until he gets the big museum built and then we could donate those. But so you see, since the number of homeowners is increasing- what? I agree that we need to build a shop. However, when it comes to building supplies, a customer's home should take priority. Yes, they should. I have every confidence that you'll find a way to handle this little puzzle. The two of you have been training under me for how many years now? This should be a piece of cake. 
Yeah, like you didn't know I was here. There's a tin. It's small. Well, hello there, Jesse. Are you happy with your home? Is it meeting expectations? Uh, it's actually pretty cute. It's just like the first the first home. It's pretty nice. Oh, I forgot we have storage, which is gonna be super great to have. <laughs> Cause I'm already just throwing stuff on the ground outside, which probably is the best idea. Uh, yep, the uh, H A. Oh my gosh, I can't say it. The home, uh, the home, the association place. Yes, yeah, say rank the homes. I've never really gotten a good score on that because I've only decorated like one or two rooms and then called it a day. And then, oh yeah, we could pay through the ABD. Good to know. It's, um, Nook Miles. Oh, yeah, Nook Miles ticket. <laughs> I'm so excited. Uh, it's conundrum. We want to improve the island, but still hold on to that. Yep. Uh, okay, yes, we can go look for some people. Perfect. The trip is yours to enjoy. I left the ticket on the counter in the airport. Oh, that's so exciting. Okay, cool. So I want to craft a shovel, though, real quick and sell a few things before we go off on our adventure. So let's go ahead and craft. Um, we can't craft the shovel. What does this need? Hardwood. One more hardwood is all we need for that. Okay, what do we need for vaulting pole? Softwood and hardwood. Good to note. Okay, let me gather those. Sell a few things. Um, let me sell stuff real quick. Congratulations on your new home. Thank you. Uh, yes, I do have a moment to chat. Okay, yeah, what is, what is the deal? Very good. I'll get right to the point. I'm hoping that you might be interested in collaborating on a new adventure. Building a new shop. After all, our little island community is growing and our needs are growing too. I'd love to offer you a much wider inventory of goods, but as you can see, I'm a little bit limited in here. I've already spoken with our fearless leader, which I happen to witness, of course, and he agrees that we have a need. Ah, uh, but here's the thing. Building materials are hard to get, so can you set them aside, or can we set them aside for building a shop? I really don't see it since we'll need these materials for residential projects, but I have an idea. You gather materials from around the island, right? From trees and rocks? I could do that. Uh, so what do you want us to gather is a thing. I think it was like 30 iron, if I remember correctly, and then I don't remember what else. 30 pieces of each wood, hardwood, softwood, and 30 iron nuggets. Okay, that's interesting. Um, I forgot all about that. Yep. Well, we can go ahead and gather those. No big deal. But I definitely need to go ahead and start collecting stuff to at least get a shovel before we go venture on our island. So that way we can get the iron ore that is there. But let me go ahead and uh, get my net equipped so we don't accidentally run into bees again today. Because that happened one too many times for my liking. Okay, uh, let me see if one more tree is good before we just start taking our axe to them. Cool, so I'm gonna go around the entire island and just do this a bunch. Okay, I have a little bit of an update. So we have donated so much that we only need one more thing and then the museum gets approved. So that's really exciting. I have a few fossils on me. I have a fish a hit, all the rocks that I can on my island. Only got about 13 iron. Um, I got a good amount of stacks of like wood and stuff, so I'm not too worried about that. But I definitely wanna get the inventory upgrade, which is 5,000, oh, excuse me, sir. I wanna donate things. Please let me know if you have any assistance. Um, make a donation. My feathers, what? Um, oh, do I have to assist fossils? Oh, gosh, darn it. Ugh, blathers, why? <laughs> yeah, because I have the fossil. Gosh, darn it, blathers. Um, I forgot what I was saying. Oh, I want to get the inventory upgrade, uh, which is 5,000 nook miles. I'm sitting at 4,300. I want to get that before I go to the island so I can just pick up as much stuff as we can and then head back. But yeah, uh, that's gonna be a while before I can get that. I'm trying my best to do as much stuff around my island as humanly possible. I'm hoping that this museum will give me uh, some sort of Nook Miles award, but we shall see. And then, uh, can I multiple select? I can't multiple select. Oh my god, Blathers, you're killing me. Uh, could it be? It's a left qu Quetzal? Like a pretzel wing? Oh no. I never thought I'd lay eyes upon this item. I'm not gonna try and say that again. Dear me, Maya, to give you- no, please. Please, no, I can't. I can't anymore. It's been good, though. Thank you. I just... <laughs> we got more stuff to do today, buddy. Uh, hmm. I do believe this means... Yes. Huzzah! Hurrah! Uh, we have finally acquired the number of specimens. Yay. Uh, my feathers, I am at a loss for words. Uh, never would have... Never would I have imagined we could reach our donation goal on this, my very first day on the island. Yeah! Don't mind me, just, uh, just balling out here. Uh, the passion, I am humbled by the spirit of Valaris. Now we can, uh, submit our application to build a proper museum. Also, who would he submit the application for? I guess Tom Nook, maybe? Like, I feel like it's an island, you can kind of do whatever. Let me talk to him and just see. Museum construction is about to begin. Okay, cool. Just making sure we got everything golden. I'll probably just display these two fossils outside. But yeah, the only other thing I have to work on right now is just getting the nook points. 
uh, to get the inventory upgrade. And then it's going to be off to the islands. Oh, we actually have Gulliver on the island. I was just kind of walking around. Let me open this on camera with you guys real quick. The message bottle. I was just picking up some, um, ooh, a pot. Interesting. I was picking up some shells to sell so we can hopefully, uh, that's a tongue twister. We can hopefully go ahead and pay off some of our loan today, but let's talk to Gulliver. See what our friend's up to. The first time on Valaris. How's it going, buddy? A honk shoe, honk shoe. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> Do we, like, kick him? Will he get up? Like, I don't know. Um, Gulliver, buddy, uh, we got, we got some business to attend to. Yeah, there you go, friend. It's okay. Oh, also, Rocket was so sweet and gave me, like, a good quality shovel. I meant to show that earlier, but I wasn't recording at the time. So now I have one good quality item. Everything else is still garbage. Uh, wait, I don't see a pizza. Where am I? Who are you? Who am I? Uh, I am none Oliver than Gulliver, a seafaring seagull of the seven seas. Uh, were you the one who kept nudging me? Yeah, a little bit. Thanks for the wake-up call. Those tasty hallucinations. Oh, no. Can you find it in your heart to forgive this? Yeah, I can forgive you. Uh, as long as you give me a little quest. And then I could do this stuff and hopefully get some Nook Miles. That'd be pretty nice. Uh, don't worry, the fellas will be here to rescue me in no time. I do wish there was a way to skip this if you've seen it before. I understand, like, the first time it's always just, like, kind of nice to see. But then Gulliver talks for a very, very long time. And I find myself, like, in late game just not talking to him very often. I kind of just leave him dead on the beach a little bit. Anyway, um, we definitely need to pick up all the stuff for his, yeah, yep, communicator parts. I'll look for them. There we go. Really? Wow, I haven't gotten a reception. Yep, okay, cool. Uh, so they're just buried in the sand. So we'll go ahead and look for a few of those together. So thank you, Gulliver. Um, I have this flimsy shovel I'm trying to break real quick, but let's see about this. Okay, it's a mussel. Interesting. Or a manila clam, that's it. And I think we get the recipe immediately. Yeah, use this bait. There we go. Okay, I'll probably just sell that right now because we don't really need it. Um, or at least, like, put it away in storage. Uh, so let me just walk across the beach and just see what we can come up with. I've also been using a vaulting pole to uh, go to different parts of the island. I was looking for rocks. There's really none. There's also really nothing interesting on the rest of my island. Uh, okay, we'll pick up a few more shells real quick while I look for the clams. Uh, it might take a while, so I might just meet you guys back when I have them. We have all the things needed for Gulliver, so we will go ahead and talk to him about that. We also have enough wood to donate, too. So there you go, buddy. That's him. Those are definitely my communicator parts. Come here, you little troublemakers. Yay, I'm so excited to have that done. I just kind of had to pull vault and walk across the beach. Um, wasn't too bad. But yeah, so let's go ahead and send a message. And then hopefully we should get something in the mail tomorrow from him. Uh, we also, I, so I bought some of the hairstyles, which was a mistake. I should have bought the inventory upgrade first. I didn't do that today. I did that like yesterday. So I still have all my points today. But yeah, uh, cause I thought we'd be able to craft a mirror and we can't. But oh, yay, good. So we did get some Nook Miles from that. So let's go ahead and scroll down. Uh, to do that, I just hold down on the right trigger, or the right joystick, and then, yeah, uh, it just kind of warps you down to wherever you need to go. But let's go ahead and run in here and donate some, oh, do we already, yeah, we already had a dragonfly, so I don't need to worry about that. I want to go in here, donate the wood at least, and then I might just kind of clear my inventory, and we'll just kind of do our best on the island. I'm nervous about it, but I think it needs to be done. So, about the shop, if we, there we go, about building a shop. Right now, we're asking for stuff. Yep, I would like to donate. I have 30, I think it's hardwood. Uh, yep, I want to go ahead and donate those. And I think all we need now is just 30 iron. Like, we only had to donate one of the three categories of wood. Yep, um, to thank you, I'd like to offer you, oh, a wallpaper. Thank you, buddy. That's very sweet. I will go ahead and display that so I can show you guys the house as well. Uh, so let's go ahead and leave. How many nook po mile points do I have again? Um, let's see. Oh, yeah, we're so close. That's what kills me. We're so close. But I don't know how to get those, like, last 400 or so. I might try and do some small quests. We'll see. Uh, but let's sell some of this stuff real quick. And then I need to put everything else, like, in my household uh, inventory. Like, all this, like, hardwood, softwood, normal wood. Um, because our tools are pretty, uh, good right now. So I don't think we'll have to craft any on the island. So I shouldn't need all this stuff. But 3,300, not too bad. So we only need about 58,000 more. Oh, and we got things for that. Yay. Okay. Good going, game. So we should be able to get that upgrade before we go to the island. I feel like that's just something that we just... Uh, I just don't want to go to the island without it. Oh, and it's a big one, too. Uh, how many did we get? We got... Yes. Oh, we can do it. Perfect, perfect. So let's go ahead and run. Put this in our house and then go to the islands, finally. 
I don't know how long this episode is gonna be. I've been watching YouTube videos while I've been doing the grind. What are you? Oh, you're a butterfly. I thought it was a tarantula for a minute. I was like, it is daytime, sir. Could you not? Tarantulas freaking scare me. Also, uh, fun fact, it is 80 degrees outside in April and, um, oh, I haven't moved my furniture yet. Whoops. <laughs> Whoopsies. Uh, we'll go ahead and place this on the wall. Yay, cute. We'll put this in storage. Put this in storage. Um, I'm gonna keep the iron on me. Keep this on me just in case we do need to craft something because I feel like soft wood's important. Put this away and put this away. And I'm feeling pretty confident about that. I'll organize the inventory later. I'm not too pressed about it. But yeah, so it's 80 degrees outside roughly. And I am inside and I'm still sweating, even with the AC on. Like it's, there's something about this apartment that the AC is just not great. I don't know what it is, but it drives me absolutely crazy. It's like I can never temperature control this apartment because if I go into the next room, it's absolutely ice cold. But this room especially just doesn't have any like airflow. It's very, very annoying. But I'm also super excited because now we can redeem the thing. So welcome to the next shop. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and redeem Nook Miles real quick and get the upgrade, uh, the pocket organization guide. Yes, finally. I think it's just one more slot if I remember correctly or is it the whole inventory? I'll have to see. But either way, I mean, it's gonna help out a lot. So your order has been printed, thank you. So relieved about that. And huh, okay. I see this totally makes sense, thankfully. Um, I learned some tricks for organizing my belongings. I bet I can carry even more stuff now. Yay! Okay, so it's just one more row. Not bad. Let me just move this up so it's not gonna drive me absolutely insane real quick. I'm sure it's been bothering you guys too. I was gonna organize it later, but nope. There we go. Already a little bit better, and we get some Nook Miles from that. I think that was one of my daily achievements, was just to spend some Nook Miles. But I'll meet you guys on the island since that does take a little bit of time. All right, we are two down and docked at the Target Island. Delta Oscar, Delta Oscar is a go. First time getting your platoons wet on tour? Uh, let me brief you on the Mystery Island, okay? So I think we should be able to find a villager on this island as well, which is really exciting. Um, I'm not gonna be too picky about the first villagers we get, um, especially when we start building the houses, mainly just cause we don't get their true house and I don't really wanna take time and invest in like some lovely villagers just to get kind of a meh house. Well, we got our shovel ready. I'm ready to get some flowers going too. We can start planting those around the island and start making it at least a little bit beautiful and maybe not as chaotic as it currently is. We also need to go ahead and hit every rock. Um, I'll say hi to the villager first. Who do we have over here? If it's a dreamy, I'm gonna be so upset. Um, who do we got? <gasps> no! No! Oh no! It's, it's a dream. Oh no. Oh, I can't. So I had Marina on my last island. Her, Meringue, and Marshall are my three favorite villagers of all time. I, my heart is broken. Oh no, I wasn't expecting to meet anyone on this tour. I'm Marina and you're Jessie from Valaris. Her actual house is so cute. Gosh darn it, Marina. Oh, my heart hurts. Okay, hi. Um, it must be true what they say about how travel broadens your horizons. The change of scenery has given me a new perspective on this life back on- Oh, I was really hoping- Out of all the villagers, there's so many bad ones. Why couldn't they give me one of those? I love her so much. You really mean it? Oh, yeah, you'll love it there. I'm sorry, bud. Gosh darn it, my heart hurts. Have you guys experienced that when you played this game too, where you found a dreamy by accident on the first island? And then you're just, oh, I'm so excited, but I'm so disappointed. I wanted her on my island eventually, but only with her true house. And we'll make it work though. She's very cute. I do love her to bits. I'm gonna go around this island and probably collect some flowers. Let me see if there's another rock. I also wanna shake all the trees and see if we can't find a DIY recipe. Uh, but then we'll kind of go back and talk to Nook and see what he has to say about all of it. So let me see real quick if there's a Bottle doesn't look like it's on this side. Oh, we could also get some coconuts too and plant those. That'll be really nice But let's go here. Is there a message in a bottle? I don't think so, but we could nope uh, I'll shake the trees and see if we can't find a piece of furniture though, and I'll start collecting some flowers, too We are back. I did catch a few bugs I also just kind of planted in patches the uh, different color flowers and also the coconut trees didn't really take too much time on it, I'm gonna be honest, otherwise I would've showed you guys. Uh, but we'll just talk to some next to what we got going on. Hello, hello, what would you like to talk to me about? 
I'm all ears. Well, I found a villager, so I don't know if I need to tell you that. That is question. Must thank you for offering to... Okay, um, he doesn't seem to care too much about the villager. But we did get Marina, so that's exciting. Uh, I think that might be where I wrap it up today. I might visit another island off camera and stuff and just see if I can't collect the last little bit of the iron ingots. Uh, but yeah, I'm kind of sad. I'm missing literally just here, if I show you guys, literally five ingots, which is really depressing. Um, but I might just kind of go around, collect some more Nook Miles, and see if I can't get a ticket and hopefully go, uh, collect another villager, maybe? If that is the case, I'll include it at the end of this video. If not, thank you guys so much for watching. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe, the whole shebang, and I will talk to you guys in the next one. So until then, bye!